We want to welcome you today to the joy of music as we share with you a special live concert on the great organ of the Roy Thompson Hall in Toronto, Canada, one of the most modern and acoustically perfect halls in all of the world. And now, let's go to the concert.
situated in downtown Toronto, Canada, is the Roy Thompson Concert Hall. When this hall opened in 1982, it created an international sensation, mainly for two reasons. First, it is known for its architectural beauty, and then for the ability to create different acoustics in the hall. Standing above the stage are 30 circular discs which are able to be moved up or down to create a specific acoustical situation, depending on the artist, ensemble, orchestra, or organ that is playing. The visual center of the hall is the Gabriel Ney pipe organ. This organ has two consoles, four keyboards each, 5,000 pipes, and 73 stops. I am seated now at the electrified console, which is movable about the stage. But standing in the middle of the pipes is a mechanical action console. These two organs, or actually one organ and two consoles, are able to play all of the literature written for the organ from the Baroque to classical to romantic to contemporary. This hall yearly sponsors the greatest artists in the world in concert, ensembles, orchestras, and is the home of the Toronto Symphony. Litanies by the French composer Jean Alain describes the soul crying out to God. The composer said this about the composition Litanies. When reason reaches its end, faith alone transcends. It is a litany, a repetition of the same phrase and melody, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, until the very end when all of the great resources of the organ are used.
Viticata Tue Petra, or Thou Art the Rock, by the French composer Henri Mulet, is written on the Bible text, Thou art the rock, and the gates of hell shall not prevail against thee. This is a French romantic toccata, with the hands playing very fast repeated chords, and the pedal playing a rhythmic line beating against the hands. The toccata, Thou art the rock. 